so for the first SEP, it says ask questions and define problems. We used that in the Chex lab by collaborating with the other people on our team and asking questions and getting their ideas on what they think the right or correct, closest to correct hypothesis would be. Um, just working together in that sense. We were asking questions with each other and we also were asking other groups at the end, near the end of our lab exercise. Um, number four, analyze and interpret data. We took the information that we had and we used that to develop our hypotheses. With that being said, the more checks we took out at a time, we learned more information, therefore somewhat changing our hypothesis. Our group's hypotheses, however, didn't really change too much because we had pretty good guesses from the get-go. So after looking at the other groups, we kind of just decided that our information was pretty much correct, but we did have a few changes. So that would relate to the fourth SEP. The fifth SEP says use mathematical and computational thinking. We definitely did this in the lab because we organized the checks by date. We had to figure out the order and we put it in chronological order so that way we could figure out what happened when, which helped us figure out kind of like the storyline in a way. And without the dates on the checks, it would be much harder to figure that out. So that was an example of how we use number five in the list of SEPs. Um, number six, construct explanations and design solutions. We did that. We practiced construction explanations by explaining what our hypotheses were as individuals collaborating as a group and then also talking with the other groups. Um, there's not going to be anyone that's going to believe you if you're not going to explain yourself. So we had to explain ourselves to our own group and to the other groups to prove why we thought that the hypotheses we came up with were the closest to the correct end of the situation, like the outcome of what the Czech lab was about, just trying to figure out what happened. Um, number eight, obtain, evaluate, and communicate information. Pretty much the entire lab, that's what we were doing. We were obtaining information by pulling the checks out four at a time. And then after discussing what a hypothesis would be for those four checks, we'd pull out four more checks. Um, we would evaluate by, um, at the end of our process, of our discussion, we would collaborate with the other groups and we evaluated what their information was. And communicating information goes hand in hand with that as well. And um, we just had our information and shared it with the other groups. So that's the eighth SEP.